Hey guys, Excali here. Um, sorry, I haven't been streaming for a long time. Work pressure, you know. But in this video, I'm gonna show you some of the shock darts which might help you help your team to push. Okay, and these are gonna be a mix of some offensive or you know uh, information gathering recon darts. So I'm gonna focus on these sites, like uh, these specific points on the map. In a set, one is this, right here, and second one is right this. here. Third one is this. right here. Fourth one. And fourth, fifth, you can say are uh, fourth, fifth, and sixth are this right one, here. Two and uh, right three, here. These three and finally in B side, right this here. one. Okay. So let's start with the A side. First one. You know that how many people hold right this uh, A tree area in the op and usually you know try to focus on the mid mark. Sorry, try to focus on the uh, mid courtyard or catwalk where we generally as an attacker enter. So the first one is I'm going to show you is how to counter that. So First of all, you need to line up your uh, arrow holder. The first arrow holders, you can see the white patch over there. Link it with this, okay? And uh, you can add bounce. I'll, I'm gonna show you without bounce, okay? Like how far it goes. Revealing so area. let's go and see where it lands. So it'll land right over here, but you want to land it right over here. here so that it gives you quite a good uh, information spot over there. So I'm just gonna turn it off, turn it on again. Yeah, I'm just gonna align myself. You just walk as soon as it stops, turn around. Okay. So, first things first, line up this. Okay, one bounce. Revealing Dots. area. Okay, now see, it will go right over inside. It's a good thing because now you have control over this area and over this area if someone's hiding over there. So, uh, again, now how does the shock darts look over there? You need to do the same, line up again with this spot. Okay, make sure it touches it. Okay, this this uh this bow moves a lot, so you need to make sure you're doing the correct thing. One bounce. Shock dart. One bounce. Shock dart. And then it goes right over there, decimating the person if he still stands there. Okay, you can add another bounce to it so that it kind of goes in and then bounces again. Okay, so that is the for that part. But if what if you want to uh, you know check out uh, this part like uh, right here, here or somewhere right here. Or over here so for that you just need to come to this box come to this big scale over here turn around okay I'm gonna turn my ghost mode on and I'm gonna show you how it exactly works so uh, you need to line up your charge bars first bar, first line of white uh, with this uh, flag pole okay and then uh, uh, you're gonna add a bounce okay revealing area okay so what happens is goes right over here okay it's a good recon dart it it will not uh, like you can shock dart over there but it's not necessary that people are standing so to you know cause havoc over there like cause crazy shock darts over there do the same stand over here one bounce shock dart okay and same on the second pole shock dart there. what happens is it goes right over there and it can really confuse a person standing over there so it will give your people in uh, the it will give your people in mid lane right to push because the person is <laughs> uh, apparently struggling with the arrows over there and it, it's a good push so the second one is uh, okay so these uh, so i covered this right area here. now i'm gonna show you right these here. two spots okay uh, so if i'm a defender uh, there are two spots i might be handling uh, one is uh, over here I might be like peeking, peeking over here, okay? Or I might be peeking from over here, right? So how to counter these, right? So what you're gonna do is the first one I'm gonna show is this one, the one over right here. Right here. So as you can see, there are like uh, three slashes over there: one, two, and three. You need to stand on that uh, first slash, okay? Just shoot it, and uh, you wanna see this triangle over here. The crosshair will be up a bit above it okay just uh, adjust yourself and then as you can see there's a triangle over here right uh like it's not a triangle but you have to imagine so there's a dot there's this and uh there's a triangle so you just need to keep it like a triangle and then uh, i'm gonna show you with the recon how far it goes revealing area one, one single thing and it lands right over here you know if the person standing over there you know how the shot that radius works so i'm gonna show you how again so the three one and two and three okay line yourself with this dot shot darts 
imagine yourself creating a triangle over there. Shock dart. One at a boss. Shock dart. For the second one. And it lands right over here. Okay? Some crazy shock darts going on over there. And for the third one, which is basically right behind here. this side, what you're gonna do is, uh, you know, it's like a running arrow, I kind of found it, you know? There's a second flagpole you can see, but uh, just below that there's an antenna. You need to line up your this thing, uh, this white bar, the second white bar, and one bounce. Shock dart. Okay, add a second bounce. Shock dart. What happens is you go right over there, and it's like you you're not allowing them to stand. And as soon as they peek, as soon as they peek, bam, bam. Okay, so this is a really good arrow if you're attacking A. Okay, like. As a SOVA, your job is to make people out. You know, if you see the stats, it says enemy displaced. So that's what shock darts are meant for. They are meant to make people move from the usual space so that your attackers can focus on killing. Okay, this one is for the uh, mid hold. Like, you don't want to peek the opper, right? You don't. So unless you're like, uh, sorry, unless you're gonna go for the op. Okay, but what if your mid mid uh, attackers right want an access over there and the support right is smoke? You're focusing on this part only. Okay, so what you're gonna do is uh, stand right over here. You know, in line. You need you need to make sure your crosshair is on this edge, not exactly in center, but this edge. And see, as you can see, you're covered. Okay, unless you peek uh, from there, you're exposed. But you're covered behind this white box. You are still prone to the, um, you know, wall bang from this box, but still. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna show exactly where the arrow lands. So you can see this edge, right? This crow, uh, this roof kind of thing. You know, one bounce, one area. power, and it'll land right over there in the center. Okay, it'll give you example of someone right standing here. over here or someone standing right in the market. It'll cause them to hide over there and give uh, give your team a push. So align again yourself with this part. Okay. Uh, bit right I suppose yeah a bit right as uh, the main thing is this this is your cue for the arrow you know, what you're gonna do is put your uh, one bound one bound over there. so it'll cause someone to you know someone's hopping over there to push themselves to the left if they try to push them from the right uh, people standing here can go for the kill you know most probably they'll run uh, inside the market but that's the whole point you're making themselves to you know push back okay and then uh, the next one is uh, over here so suppose you're standing over here without exposing yourself uh, you have to check uh, the two ways you can go with the drone but I'm gonna show you specifically how you're gonna arrow it out so the first one is uh, the person sitting on right this here. part so you wanna you know align yourself with this part uh, put your crosshair exactly over here. No power. Shock dart. Calling the person to you know get hit over here. A second one, people stand over here. Right here. Okay. So you gonna do is uh, stand right, you know, with this until this wall ends, this orange color part, or align yourself here. Okay. So uh, just one bounce. Shock dart. Half charge. It will hit exactly over there. And the next one is uh, you're gonna stand over at uh, this part until you see the this thing this right here slice kind of thing slash kind of thing. Uh, so I think you should just look at this uh, eyebrow kind of thing. Stand over here, okay. So what it's gonna do is one bounce, one revealing power, area. And you're gonna land right over there. See, it's gonna land right over this corner. So again, align yourself with this uh, spot. Okay right above this okay sorry for my accent but right above this and uh just shock half dart. bounce shock dart it will gonna dismiss. you can add some bounce over there you know one more bounce to you know delay but uh if someone is staying over there they're gonna get decimated uh and the last one is uh by average jonas he has got a good uh, spot for getting people right here catching off guard over here so what i'm gonna do this, is uh metal Shesh or whatever over here, mesh or whatever. So you just need to put a cross exactly in the center. Okay, you need to line up. I'm gonna show you with uh, ghost mode on how bad does it exactly go. So you wanna line up with this, uh, you know, this uh, black hole or whatever is that, and then two revealing area, two charge. 
okay uh, yeah to bounce so as you can see it landed right over here so same thing the stand over here stand over here correctly line up yourself in the center there are two things basically you need to line up with this for the first shock dart and for the second shock dart you need to line up with this for the first shock dart it's gonna be uh, no bounce two power and for the second one is one bounce one power okay first one is no bounce shock dart power and second one is on this top one bounce shock dart what you're gonna see is like this it's gonna land over there and bam so these are some of the lineups which uh, i personally would be using a lot so learn them these shock darts are not 100 percent kill guarantee these are mostly causing for displacement and by displacement i mean if someone is you know um holding that spot over there right here you know and if someone has managed to reach over this part uh supposedly like a jet with a speed so they can get this guy over there and some of the common spots are this like uh shock dart you know this one it will definitely catch someone over right here. here and do not forget to line up with this shock one shock dart this is a common spot for people to hide when you're running over there and you're killed over there so yeah so guys this is from me uh, i have tried to make it as short as possible uh, i'll be adding more so this is like version zero of my lineup lineups uh, series so let me know in the comment section below like uh, if you have any suggestions if you st already knew this um, lineups and if you saw it from other youtuber or someone please do let me know i would like to give them the full credits maybe i found it late but the first ones except the average owners one are entirely found by me uh, unless it is already found by someone else so disclaimer all credits to someone who's already found it again if you're new to this channel please please do subscribe i i am focusing on making valorant content especially montages and such lineup and tutorials so drop a like below let me know in the comment section and if you're new please do subscribe and do hit the bell icon so take care guys that's it excalibur signing off